looks like an otter has been here. It's one of those little freshwater mussels that uh, you see an otter has been eating around here. Make a pretty good makeshift knife if you had to try to cut into something fine, like clean a fish or something. Anyway, kind of cool. One of the frustrating things is just this, like picking through it every time, trying to find your stuff. The food barrel, this one's actually a little worn, but it's supposed to be airtight, watertight. But, um, excuse me. Excuse me, Bella. Bella. Were you gonna, that's what you've selected for breakfast, is the cheese? Have you selected the cheese for breakfast? The cheese isn't for you. Oh. Oh. The cheese isn't for you. Bella. Get the cheese, can I have the cheese bag? Oh, thank you. Thank you for bringing me this cheese. No. No. <laughs> No. Bella. Can you have it? Thank you. up to just a beautiful freaking day and then I felt like I turned around and the clouds were in and thunder started and it started raining rained pretty heavily there for a bit but uh now it's just kind of a tranquil calm rain and it's it's uh humid out so it's not too cold Heather's not feeling the best this morning she's got a bad headache and um you know it's hard to stay hydrated out here and sometimes with your neck and all the weight you're carrying and the way you're sleeping it happens to me too i get headaches quite frequently so she's just trying to uh, get some food in her and feel a little better but we'll we'll kind of wait that out and um just kind of uh enjoy the spot that we're at here i really like this spot i mean our tent spot was really tight last night but in the end i thought it was okay very cool like overhanging the water here I felt bunch of fun rapids today and so I'm looking forward to running some fun rapids are you barking at the thunder belly good girl How are you doing, Heather? A little bit better now that I've uh, got some food in me. And I'd fill up pretty soon, but uh, right now I'm just enjoying this fruit cup. Mm. <laughs> peaches. Millions of peaches. Peaches for me. 
millions of peaches, peaches for free. This um, cedar here is actually like working really well to block the rain. I mean, it's raining pretty hard and it's just as good as a tarp thus far. Yeah, I like it under here. I like it under here. Is that true, Jelly? You like it under there? She's mm -hmm. in her element. She's a, a wild, a wild fawn. Look at that fawn, freshly born. Well, it looks like it's gonna be a day of rain travel. Hopefully on and off, but uh, maybe it'll bring the water up a smidge. Would have helped us yesterday. It's actually kind of pretty, like it's it's raining, but it's humid. And there's kind of a cool mist coming off all the, uh, the trees. So hopefully it's still a good day and we're not too, too saturated by the end. It's just one of those days that feels like it's going to rain endlessly at a good clip, yeah. unfortunately, but uh, still pretty out. All right. I feel like uh, we're just going down a hill constantly, you know? So this is a C1 test. But it looks bouldery. The rocks are even harder to see because the water's so dark. Right. We have no sun. Ugh, I hate that. Okay. Forward, we have to split these rocks forward hard. Dead center! Forward hard, cross draw, forward, draw. Cross draw. Forward, forward. Cross draw. All right, get left hard, forward hard. Yeah, it's gonna go straight. Yeah! Woo! Woo! So technical, eh? Standing on the gunnels the whole time, eh? What a dog. Yeah. Still, like, they're really technical. Well, you water has such a powerful water. force that if you get hung up, like, it doesn't matter yeah. if the current isn't crazy. It's like you can't just ride the train. You know, no. like you gotta right. maneuver a lot. Yeah, see my glasses are getting wet, so if they get really wet, I won't be able to see. Bella, get back. Come on. Back. Stay. Stay. This sounds big. This one's a uh, class two. This is the, the with the one with the ledges. Oh. This so looks that's, good that's... from top, but suggest left bank carry. So let's go from the left bank. Okay. okay? Apparently there's a couple ledges at the bottom. Looks pretty straightforward here. It says look straight forward from the top. 
but double ledges at the bottom. It's nice to have river notes, you know, like normally a lot of the trips I do, just the one to 50 topographic maps and often stuff isn't marked at all or uh, it's just a couple lines and you don't really know how serious it is. Sometimes there's a waterfall that's not marked, you know, so. Looks like far right is a good option right from the top. Thanks for waiting and not ditching me. I heard her howling when I first left. Oh, Were you howling? Oh, but she stayed. So far right? Yeah, we're gonna go middle and then get right. Okay? Yellow. Forward. Another class two. Flow pose canoe left. Looks like just big waves down the right. Stay right. Watch walk at entrance to twin boulders. Hard right, very after. I don't see rock at entrance at all. I see a rock straight ahead. I see a lot of boulders down there. But I don't know what's further. All rock I think we stay left. Yeah, I think we stay left of that. Rocks here, we get left and then we get right. As current pushes you last, that's exactly what happened. <laughs> Looks a little more uh, possibly daunting than the last two, eh? We might have to line. Line to here in low water on the right. Yeah. Then run, then scout. And then we got to get left of center. Okay. So I guess I'll pull up on the right because I think the water's pretty low, although it's coming up fast with this freaking rain. I know. Um, it is. Which is probably good because things have been so low. So I'll pull up here and we'll check it out. Maybe we'll line scout run, like it says. Probably what we should do. Is it ever raining? Holy smoly. Oh, 
Okay, Bella. Okay. Okay. Girl. right now and then we're gonna get left okay okay forward Right bank portage, best option. Oh yeah, here it is, the sign's here. today approximately because I know we said scenic shoots but that seems too close uh, well we're just moving quick now burnt island lake I guess like at least yeah for sure because there's a couple campsites at burnt island and then it doesn't show campsites again till way down river so log jam rapids rock garden in low water so it's going to be a rock garden and then gooseneck rapids it says brace exclamation mark which is a little nerve-wracking looks like doomsday up ahead Oh yeah, I see that middle. That's a lot of rock. boulders down at the end. Where do we get middle? I see where that we run right. Then we gotta get over. It says that we can get right again after it pushes us left. I think we can do it. We're, we're doing it. <laughs>
nuts! More boulders than I realized. I think Goose Neck's just up here. I'm a little concerned where it says brace. Okay, so we're just gonna go down this and then I'll try to have a look from the island. But like, straight to. to the island or are we going left or right? Or or... I think we're gonna run the island left. But if we go down here, I should be able to see, you know what I mean, around the corner and see what's up. Really get down. with the smell of like the pines and the forest. Yeah, it smells really nice. So we're done, Little Steel, the whole thing? Yeah, that's Little Steel. So what is so it? So Little now? Steel Falls coming up, Portage 340 yards. Do so not run. Already at Burnt Lake, basically. After the falls, like we actually are supposed to run some of it. Or you can. Like see wrap, oh, it's a class, class four. four. Yeah, yeah, that's the one, yeah. So this cool. is the one I'm thinking, like... Most mortals should take we, the portage. We lined the, we actually lined the falls. <laughs> See the end? Brace and hold left to avoid haystack. By caution, use of spotters recommended. Most mortals should take portage. Anyway. The whole thing is for, uh, 340 yards. Weird that it wouldn't be marked right before it falls. This is where everybody takes out, you can tell. How do I look? Knee pads, helmet, glasses, hat. Not a fashion show out here, that's for sure. not easy it's never easy but found some more golden chanterelles mm. check Good it out Good luck, man. here they are little ones now that that one's kind of rotted now they get much bigger Whole bunch of golden shine trials. Right here. Oh, so tiny. I know. I think um they get quite big though. Cook these up for dinner tonight. Hopefully paired with a fish again. Mm -hmm. Yummy yummy. For lunch today, right before the portage, we are having peanut butter pitas. Mm. Nothing but five star luxury. You travel with us. We're wet. My underwear is soaked. I didn't even eat breakfast yeah. that long ago, but, um, you know, it's a lot of physical work we're doing. Looks like the sun is kind of breaking out a bit. Heather. It's still raining, but like I see a bit of hope 
through. <laughs> in full rain gear, yet I feel like I just jumped in the lake. Yeah. It's like, what is the point? I'm getting a really bad headache. Going up, up. Yay. Mmm. Mmm. Well. Hi, Mom. Hi, Mom. Well, we are at a portage here. Portage, portage, tomato, tomato. Um, Heather says it's tomato and portage. And potato. And schedule. It's not schedule. Is it a moth or a moth? A moth? Um, um, so we have, um, it's about 340 yards the whole shot, but there's a couple sections we're going to check. If we can scout well from there, we will probably run from a little further up. Um, maybe we'll drop our stuff, check, you know, go drop our stuff, check. I don't know. It's supposed to be a class four, then a class three, then a class two or something. Judging by how bouldery things are, um, because of the water level, some stuff I think that's runnable normally uh, wasn't with our heavy, heavy boat. Um, Cause we just get hung up, but maybe we can like line a bit and then run it. So anyway, um, that's what we're gonna do. We'll see how we're feeling, but it's been like a saturated day. So sometimes you just uh, wanna throw in the towel, but uh, we'll take a look at the map and decide. It's nice to have Bella. She's having a fun time. And she protects us from bears. Mm -hmm. Don't you guys? You need a girl? You need a venture puppy? Venture pointer? Point? It's, it's fun to have her and it's kind of hilarious running all these rapids with her on the boat too. A little adventure dog. Really careful. Put your bag down if you have to. Found a whole bunch more chanterelles on the trail. Sweet. Stop here. go to the rapid and I think I think we'll make it. It would be a fun, fun one. A wet one. Adrenaline pumping. But uh, I was telling Heather there's a chance we're gonna dump because you know, there always is, but this one a bit more. And she says she'd rather not do that. The other thing is we have to run all of these with Bella on the boat. 
it's pretty challenging to run it with a dog. She just squeals and swims after you down the river. So we have to think of her. Uh, from up there, it's a, a class four. From here, it's a, a class three. Normally, I would completely love that. Yeah. I think it's just this weather. It's, uh, it's affecting me. I get a lot of headaches, migraines, all that fun stuff. It's been a pretty wet day and uh, both of us have a chill it's just been raining on us endlessly and uh, after just hours of uh, being wet it starts to wear on you Have you, have you put on your poodle feet? you put on your poodle feet? Look at that. Oh, you're so cute. Bella's been stabbed standing in this foam. Where's your poodle feet? Put on your poodle feet. She's <laughs> cute. She's so cute. Good girl. Good girl. I decided to solo the last bit with no gear and it was so much easier and safer like that and heck of a fun thing. Are we going left of this? No, it's the left. crazy it just there was something about it like this morning like what a day and like it was warm you know right and then i just like blink and then it stopped and like oh it looks like it changes the worst after the thunder thing it just this this kind of gray you just know it's gonna rain for a long time you know do we have another rapid here i think this is s rapid or I don't know, it says run right to left. Yeah. 
class one. Same with S Rapids and S then Rapids is Swift. Class two. Is it? Yeah. Okay, so the run right to left is the class one. The leg at the bottom. Belly, get back. Back. S rapid? I think so, yeah. Hate when you can't see what's around the corner. I'm standing, so I can see a lot more. So we're gonna hug the, the left and avoid the big waves. Is the ledge on the left or the right or the middle? I think the left is in the middle. Done though, I'm not gonna lie, but so much further, but let's check it like go past the I site. I feel like we'll whip there, you know, at this rate. I just don't want to have to like get out right. and you know, what is this? Swift, run swift, one, two, three, or something. There's nothing, this is just a swift. Wow, is it ever raining now? Yeah. Yeah, I'd like to get to camp. I'm done with this rain. <laughs> Getting cold, you know? How did you say dry? <laughs> I don't know. I just had rain gear, like brand new, and uh, just basically got out of the rain. Like, bad move to stay in the rain all day out there, you know, because it's ice rain. It's not warm rain like this, you know? Right. Oh, is this Burnt Lake? Are we already there? No, this is like where the campsites are. It's like a little uh, lake off Burnt Lake. Oh, uh, okay. And between here and Burnt Lake, I think there's only like, whatever, that rapid, that rapid is Watch the rock, babe, it's shallow. I am so over this rain. Good thing we have an arc in our animal. <laughs> <laughs> We need another one though. I'm not even seeing any fan sites right now. Nothing. No opening, nothing. Ah, 
wanna know Have you ever seen the rain? Coming down Sunday Someone told me long ago Sun is hot and rain is cold I know Been that way for all my life I'm only happy when it rains Nice I'm, I'm only, only happy when it's complicated <laughs> How does it go? What's the rest of that? Uh, something about, you know, I can't appreciate it. I'm only happy when, when it rains. rains. I'm only happy when it rains. <laughs> I used to know the whole song. I'm only um, happy when it Something about, feel so bad. Something, 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 rain. <laughs> <laughs> Pour your misery down. Pour your misery down on me. Pour your misery down. Pour your misery down on me. I'm only happy when it rains. I met them. Garwood. Cool. Good old Shirley man. This is the scenic view. Up here. Yeah, up that. We'd have to we'd have to paddle up there to look at them. Oh, you wanna check it out? I just see nothing along here but thick bush. Way up there. Right. And have to pour. Uh, see, if we want to see those tomorrow, we can go there too. But tomorrow we're seeing the Phoenix Falls, by the way. Yeah, that was a sight that I noticed. That definitely was a sight. Like, you want to just turn back or do you want to just run this rapid here and go to the next lake? You want to turn back? Well, there's more than one rapid though. Is there? I don't think so. I don't know. You've got a couple of lines there before. Cliffhanger. That's it. And then old log slide. What's that? Yeah, that's that's not a rapid. That's just like a historical logging day thing. Okay, let's just push on, but... Are you sure? Yeah, I Because, like, there is a site right here, Heather. That's not as high as a walk-up as that. I don't know. All right, we're pushing on. I guess. All right. Probably pretty late, probably like six, you know? Okay, let's just paddle and get there. Let's see the note. Flip to the note, 22. Good, yeah, old road, there's a campsite up there. Yeah, let's stay there. You wanna go there? Yep. But we could also bomb that and then we'd be in Burnt Lake, so... Keep your eye out a bit on the left, just in case there's another site. It's like cliff to me.
cliffhanger. Says it's 300 feet. Maybe to the actual summit. Okay, so where's this campsite? <laughs> Looks like there is there one right there. There's one at 12 o'clock. Perfect. Left? Yeah. That's our spot. Yay! Yay! Those are awesome cliffs. They are. We get some pictures tomorrow of them. Huh. Oh, look here at how much higher they get. Oh, I guess yeah. 300 feet, like that's 100, Barren Canyon 300 feet. It looks like feet. a cross up there. I think it's just a broken tree though. Yeah. Barren Canyon 300 feet, right? Like if you were on the top of that. Is it maybe, 300? It's 100 meters. Barren which is Canyon? like 310 feet. But it's so like straight down that... I don't know. Oh, I want some hot chocolate so bad. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm getting real, really cold. That might just be marking the historical spot. Obviously, people camp here though, too. Okay, honey. What a spot. Heather approved? Yeah. Sure. I like this one more yeah. too. I think this is a better spot. Than I've seen. Package delivery. Aww. Cute package One delivery. brown loin. Are you loin? Here. Loosen the tab.
So even when it's been raining this much, if you find a dry, dead tree, dead standing, especially one the bark's fallen off of, it's usually dry and not rotted, and you split the middle out, and then the middle inside here is totally bone dry. It's a little more work, but that's how you can get, get really dry wood after, um, you know, these incredible rains. After eight, haughty sea, after a long day in the hammering rain. Would you like this one? Yes, please. Thank you, Jenny. Jenny? Jenny? She's like, she's drooling because she knows the bag's here. We'd go and make the dinner. Getting the lake dinner just like us. Hers is much earlier than ours, so. This hottie sea's uh, hitting the spot here. Pretty After good, a long, uh, kind of cold and wet day, it's nice to warm up by the fire with a nice cup of hot chocolate. After eight flavored, too. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, I put a splash of uh, rum in mine. And uh, it's really good. Hot, uh, after eight, hot chocolate with a splash of rum. Highly recommend it. Uh, I just changed into some dry clothes. I've been soaked to the bone. Both of our rain gear needs to be updated because it doesn't actually work anymore for any length of time. And like we're soaked down to our undies. Um, I'll you know, admit it rained nonstop, endlessly, all day from when we left camp till just now. Um, but, uh, so I just changed into dry clothes at about 10 o'clock. Anyway, now we're gonna start making camp pizzas. <laughs> there's the pile of wet clothes there. And uh, there's actually plenty more where that came from. Soaked to the bone. Like you could whip someone to death with those. They're so wet. <laughs> you death. know what I mean? They're heavy, right? Like you could really punish someone with those undies that I have there. <laughs> Not to mention the stench of them would kill them. <laughs> yeah. 
You like some more of that? Oh. Bella, where are you, where are you off to with that? Oh my goodness. Bella, you going where, for a stroll? where are you going? You going for a stroll with the, with the week's worth of dog food? Where are you going with that? <laughs> You're so cute. Good girl. You're so cute. Yes, you are. Good girl. Oh. <laughs> where are you going? Can I have that? Thank you. Thank What's that you. <laughs> oh, you need to take the juice. The juice? <laughs> You don't want the juice. You don't like juice. <laughs> oh. And do three pizzas again. Here. We didn't, uh, it was just dumping rain and we didn't take the time to catch a fish today. So we're going to pair the chanterelles that I found with our pizza. Seems fitting. Yummy. There they are. A little crispy on this side, but not too bad. Um, there's the mushrooms in there. Looks good. Mm. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my right time girl. If you refuse me, love. If you refuse me, honey, you lose me. Darling, kiss me and tell me I'm your own. Mm. The calzone with the chanterelles. It is actually freaking delicious. They're they're kind of. You, it's hard to get the flavor of them uh, with every bite, but when you do, it's it's actually really good. Mm. They're um, they're a mild flavored mushroom, but they're really good. So these camp calzones, once again, have knocked it out of the park. So good, highly recommend them. <laughs>